The deployment of S-300 air defense system by Russia in Abkhazia, a breakaway Republic of Georgia, is a direct response to the recent moves by the United States to consider expanding the BMD program into Czech Republic, Romania, and Bulgaria. The United States' response to the deployment of the S-300 system in Georgia has been somewhat disjointed. Philip Crowley, Assistant Secretary of the United States Department of State, has said that the move was not surprising, that the United States has uh, thought that there were S-300s in Abkhazia for the past two years, in fact. However, senior administration officials have told Stratfor that the U.S. is still formulating response and is still trying to determine whether the system is in Georgia or not. Fundamentally, Russia is consolidating its hold on the Caucasus. In only the uh, past few months, Russia has extended the lease on its base in Armenia and has increased its troop levels in both Abkhazia and South Ossetia to 1,500. It now has S-300 air defense systems in both Armenia and in Abkhazia. Up to this point, Russia and the United States have seemed to have made an understanding on several issues. First of all, uh, Russia has given in uh, its support on Iran, uh, an issue that is not necessarily central to Moscow, but extremely important to the United States, which is trying to disentangle itself from Iraq, where Iran plays a key role. Meanwhile, the United States has offered investments and, and uh, support for American companies going to Russia, bearing both investments and projects for the modernization, which from Moscow's perspective is crucial for its economy. Therefore, both Moscow and Washington have uh, offered an olive branch on an issue that is not particularly important to one, but is to the other. However, when we look at the issues that are important to both Russia and the United States, we haven't seen any particular evidence of detente. Issues such as BMD or Russian presence in the Caucasus, particularly in the breakaway republics of Georgia, which is nominally a U.S. ally. Therefore, what we're looking for next is whether the United States increases in any meaningful way its support for Georgia. If not, we're looking whether the response from Washington will come perhaps in Central Europe by moving further with the BMD. Interestingly, Slovakia has indicated that it is also interested in having some sort of a role in the system, and this could be uh, a way for the United States to respond to Russia.